When children have opportunities to play with sounds inside words, this supports their development of phonological awareness. In these classrooms, teachers use transitions as opportunities for children to play with sounds. For the transition today, since the children are so excited about rhyming, um, I made up a rhyming book with their names. So I'm going to read it, and then as they hear the rhyme, hopefully they will start to connect that it rhymes with their name, but they will ultimately see it when I lift the flap, and they will see their picture. So that's a fun way to get them excited about rhyming is when you start rhyming their names because every child wants to hear their name in a rhyme. So that's one way to get them excited about that and start the rhyming process. So we are going to use this to move to our next area, which is what? What is our next part of the day? Small group. Small group. But you have to wait. But listen, it's really important that you hear this, okay? So put your listening ears on really loud so you can hear. There's something very special inside, okay? I'm going to show you the first page. It says, Tippity Toppity Taji, a turtle sat on. What could rhyme with Taji? Can you think of anyone in our class that rhymes with Taji? Naji. 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 Tippity Toppity Taji, a turtle sat on. Naji. Naji and Taji rhyme. When you see your picture and hear your name, you, and you're in Miss Hajra's group, you can go to the table. If you are in Miss Amy's group, you're just going to stay right here with me, okay? Okay. So, for example, in the book, it would say, Tippity Toppity Tammy, a turtle sat on, and then we lift it, the flap up, and there would be a picture of me with my name, Amy. So they're hearing Tammy, Amy. Tippity Toppity Tilliam, a turtle sat on. Oh, yeah. Right, William. Tippity Toppity Tolly, a turtle sat on. Ali. Ali. Ali, you can transition to your table. Tippity Toppity Toussaint, a turtle sat on. Hussein. Hussein. And Tippity Toppity Tage, a turtle sat on. Paige. Paige. Paige, you can stay right here. Tippity Toppity Tahan, a turtle sat on. Jahan. Jahan. Jahan, go ahead and go to your table. And Tippity Toppity Tash, a turtle sat on. Mesh. Mesh rhymes with Tash. And our last one is Tippity Toppity Tala, a turtle sat on. Sala. Sala. Sala, you can go to your table. Literacy is a big part of our day from the time that they walk in until the time that they leave. So as teachers, we're always looking for, for new ideas and new ways to incorporate it, whether it's during transitions, whether it's activities for small group or activities for large group. So we're always trying to encourage more literacy in the classroom. One of the things we like to do in preschool is have meaningful transitions. So instead of everyone getting up at once, we try to have it a little bit more orderly. So I thought it would be a really good opportunity to practice sounds. So the pre-K students get ready for outside. I'm going to do a really playful transition. And instead of calling them by their name, we're going to give clues. And the clue is going to be the beginning sound in their name. And that's how they'll get ready to line up for outside. We're going to get ready to go outside. But we're going to be sneaky spies that get ready today. So when you walk, you're going to tiptoe to the door. So think for a minute, because I'm going to give you some clues. We're going to start with somebody that will be the line leader today. Linaya, could you please tiptoe to the door? Now it's time for the clues. We're going to listen for the clues. I'm not going to say your whole name. I'm just going to say part of the sounds. If your name starts with the sound B, tiptoe to the door. Mm. There's a spy, B. One of the things we did to make it a little bit more playful and a little bit more exciting is they're really into spies now and detectives. And we also want them to be calm when they're getting ready for outside, so we played with that. This one's a little bit different because this sound is the same letter as the beginning of the name. It's the letter A. Tippity toppity 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 it's really exciting that they solved the mystery. As silly as it sounds to us, there's something really empowering about figuring that out and putting that mystery together. And when they make those connections and realize the beginning sound that goes with their name or the letter that goes with their name, there's something really powerful about that. Let's do ja. There's a 
This is another tricky spy name because it's the same letter at the beginning of her name, O. Olivia. Olivia does start with O. And then let's do the spy that starts with the beginning sound, K. Oh, I tricked you. Let's do the spy that starts with the sound, Qua. Yeah, go ahead, spy. I think the main job of pre-K is we set that foundation where learning is exciting and I feel I have the best job in the world and it means a lot to make the difference when they first come to school. Learn more at literacyessentials.org.